uh, hello friends today in this uh, tutorial i will basically show you how you can add uh, custom fonts of uh, every language inside your pdf document so if you click the pdf uh, let me show you uh, you can see there is a hindi language font it is primarily used in indian country and uh, very popular language you can insert any language arabic hindi or english Japanese, Vietnamese and I will be showing you you can browse Google fonts go to Google fonts and basically you can search for any language fonts available and uh, just click fonts and here you will get your filter language select any language Chinese or if you select here all these fonts will come right here and you can select your favorite fonts and the process is very simple and I will show you how you can do that uh, first of all uh, just uh, make a simple index.html file and uh, include and the library that we will be using guys in the last three videos we used this library which is PDF lib this is basically a browser side library which allows you to modify your PDF documents and also you can create PDF documents as well so we will use this library and the very first thing you need to do we need to include the you can go to the CDN uh, official documentation you will find out these CDNs available to you two files you need to be included one for the base library and the second one will be for the including custom fonts so first of all we are using pdf lib and pdf lib slash font kit so this is required guys for including custom fonts inside uh, the pdf document so just include these and now we can have a button after you click this button your pdf file will be generated we will give it an on click listener to it so whenever we click this button this uh, function will execute which is generate PDF and we will basically make a new file index.js and we will write our JavaScript code here in this file so first of all we will include this function which is generate PDF and inside this function guys what we will say font URL and this file guys TTF file you need to store it inside your root directory so we have successfully stored hindi.ttf and custom.ttf so I will also show you how you can basically get this file from google fonts and after you get this you just need to read this file guys by using await fetch and we will pass the font url and here you need to convert this into uh, array buffer and we can easily do this using uh, javascript using a function which is available to us array buffer this will convert this uh, fonts into base64 array buffer after that we can basically insert this using this method pdf lib dot pdf document dot create it will actually create a pdf document for us and then what we need to do we just need to register this font so we will say register font kit this is a function inside a PDF lib library you will actually pass the font kit which is there and then we will be say here custom font we will apply this custom font PDF doc dot embed font this is a method guys you need to use embed font and here you need to pass the font bytes variable so after doing this guys we just need to actually add a page in the PDF document so for adding the page we will say pdf doc dot add page and uh, after that we will write some text and uh, you can basically copy this uh, you can use google translate to translate your text from english to hindi whichever language you are basically targeting text size i will give 35 and uh, the text width all these are customizable guys you can just change these values accordingly text width will be custom font dot width of text as I will calculate dynamically using this function and we will pass the text and the text size and uh, then guys we will also calculate the height of the text as well 
using this custom font dot high tech size text size text size variable that's all so now we will draw this text guys on the screen draw text we will draw this text and the second argument takes is the x coordinate and also it takes the y coordinate y coordinate let me say 450 size of the text will be text size and the color of the text will be pdf lib dot rgb which is red green value red green blue and here you can provide here 0 0.053.0.71 and after that guys you will simply save this file you will say pdf doc save it will save this file and after that you just need to download this file so for this we will have a custom function download pdf we will pass the pdf bytes and the name custom dot pdf so this function we written in the last tutorial as well guys so i will not write this once again so this basically takes a pdf bytes uh, and the custom file name so it creates a blob object guys passing the mem type which is application slash pdf and it creates a dynamic link element and it downloads the file as an attachment by clicking the link as a dynamically so this is a code right here simply copy this code pause the video and just write this code and now this completes the application now if you open the pdf document guys this hindi text will be written right here if you click this button a pdf file will be downloaded it is saying pdf doctor register phone kit is not a function uh, let me see Uh, register font kit I think there is some kind of problem in writing this code so I will simply copy this code guys and paste it inside the code is working guys it was just a problem in the spelling mistake you can now see guys the file is generated custom phone dot pdf and uh, if you open this this text will be written right here if you see the quality looks pretty well and now i will tell you guys how to obtain the ttf file so just go to your google phones and uh, go to this website and select your language if you are giving an arabic want to do you can basically select this font click on that button download family it will download that ttf file a zip file first of all we need to extract this file click on extract all it will have this uh, ttf file guys and simply uh, cut this file and paste it inside your working directory so paste it and here replace it by arabic and if i include this file ra right now if i say here arabic.ttf and here we just need to translate also use google translate so whatever is your text you can use this free tool available to you just write any text my name is gotham and translate this text from english to i think arabic so simply copy this text and paste it here if you open this now and now your pdf document is ready right now you can see that so now arabic text is there so in this way guys you can basically select any custom font of any language using google fonts inside your browser using this pdf lib library it's a very awesome library guys which you can perform any task this was the fourth video on this library and please subscribe this channel guys like the video i will keep posting more advanced tutorials of this library and also programming videos as well so